This lesson on statistical inference is a continuation of the previous lesson that covered sampling. Taken together, these two lessons, sampling and inference, are focused on drawing conclusions from a sample of an underlying population. A specific intuitive example is a situation in politics with elections, where a sample of likely voters will be asked which candidate they prefer, and the results will be reported as a predicted average number and wrapped around that will be a range, the margin of error. And we'll hear that what they can say is a certain likely result, plus or minus a certain amount. In business situations, that same kind of work is done to understand manufacturing processes, the performance of salespeople, the production efforts of various manufacturing facilities. In many such cases, you have information only about a sample, either because that's all that's available, or it wouldn't be economical to extend and get larger samples unless you really need them. Statistical inference gives you the information you need to start thinking about how large does that sample need to be to have a level of a competence that's appropriate to the situation at hand. Whereas the previous lesson on sampling was focused on conceptually developing the thought processes and concepts needed in order to arrive at the central limit theorem, the focus of this lesson will be on putting that arrived conceptual understanding to work. And fortunately for us, the mechanics from the central limit theorem have already been addressed in the normal distribution lesson. Because the central limit theorem represents a normal distribution, going forward from there and drawing conclusions involves using mechanics we've seen. And specifically, what we'll be talking about is confidence intervals, those bands around the predicted result and what that means, and in some cases does not mean. And then also hypothesis testing, where a certain idea about a situation can be put to the test and you can get results back that give you some indication of how likely it is that a given hypothesis does hold in a particular situation.